Alright, hello, welcome back to a new series, Princely Federation. I keep doing this tease to you guys where I keep saying we continue series, but uh, due to the new Hearts of Iron update, my save got destroyed from Mongolia, and I literally can't unpause the game without the game crashing, so that's very unfortunate, but we're back in Asia for probably like the fifth time in a row. Um, I guess it's just because mostly I've done Europe so much and other, you know, single player campaigns and all that. That I've kind of gotten bored of doing Europe. I mean, we did the France campaign. Um, might come back to do something else. I don't know. It's all kind of a mess in Europe. But I was thinking about doing Middle Africa, but I'm probably not going to do that in Kaiser Redux. I'll just do that in Kaiserreich. And then uh, we're obviously going to just try to unite to India. And to do that, we got to obviously take out the Bahrain Commune. And we gotta take out Delhi too, so we gotta help them take out Baluchistan, which should be soon. So we'll send this guy over to Afghanistan as soon as that war starts, and then we can kind of make some moves. And send one division. Okay. Well. This guy's got max entrenchment, so he might... Than this guy. So I've rarely seen Afghanistan actually win this war, which doesn't really help me, but we'll kind of see how they do here. The last thing I want is Afghanistan being a puppet of India, because then that literally fucks me over. Uh, I also do want to help out Chinese, but I don't think I'm going to be able to do that yet. We're going to hold off on this, because I know these guys are going to splinter up a lot more. Yep. There's that one, and then you gotta get Nian King. There's Anhui. Okay. And there's these guys. There's these guys. How many volunteers can I send you? We'll send you one. So we are losing land here. Do I not get my division back? Great, that's chaotic. I think this is probably lost cause, but we'll try to do some damage at least. Once the left Comintang goes to war with someone, we'll support whoever they're at war with. Because I don't want a communist ally in the region. Okay, 
rip Afghanistan. They lasted a total of like five minutes. Probably centralize the command. It's probably going to give us. We don't really need any of this stuff. This way we can make uh, motorized. Okay, let's help out these boys. Shit, who fell the single syndicalism? Is Brazil? No. Chile. Poland is communist. Okay. Who is sending volunteers? I saw someone sent volunteers. Who's supporting you? Ah, oh, of course these punks are. Hey, me, Japan, and uh, Manchuria, all in this together. Look at that. The unstoppable team. We'll do centralized, just because I'm not too concerned about getting bombed. Where's Japan's? Okay, so Japan has a volunteer there. Do they have any others? No. We have Indians fighting Indians here. I am. Authoritarian still. That works for us, because so are we. Syndicalist finish. And we're able to trap the other national and seizing power in declaring republic. So there's a lot going on right now. Bohemian governor, okay. Doesn't concern me really. Eastern Siberian Republic. We need a lot more troops in the field, it looks like. And then Finland, you are cyclist. Yeah.
Could do that if we had the command power. I don't know what the fuck is going on at this point. We still have Burma as an ally, though, for now. Okay, they're breaking through multiple places. We need uh, a lot more troops to kind of help out here. Old Paragon of Justice Right, Imperial bring these okay. Let's get to early mob. That should kind of help us a little bit with our economy. So we have a few breakthroughs here, and they have one breakthrough here. I don't know what this is going to do for us in the long run. Okay, we lost our... Well, it looks like they're making some progress around up here towards the Japanese corridor. the artillery specialist and our first two divisions are not even close because we don't have enough infantry equipment let's just try to like hold as best as we can the casualties in this war are interesting 8k to their 30k they probably have tons of manpower, though, so 30k is probably not a, you know, dip in the bucket for them. But they don't have a lot of equipment, so them ramming it into us like this, even if that sounds very overtly sexual. The good thing for us is that they won't be able to kind of get new. Okay. Special to present in Plodora, likely intended to put more power in their hands. Dissolve the council. What the fuck is this? Time is to come, clear change, hereby known as the Indian Empire. In Osmond, it's Kaiser El Hind. I would thrust him, people will cheer on his champion, his promise to regain control of some continent. Under. Well, some might have assumed he's had imperial intentions. The truth is that he intended solely to centralize the government's power in his hands for the benefit of all. Okay. Yeah, no, we are uh, elections. Who the fuck do they think we are? You know what? We're going to save here. Just in case, because you can see that's the save that's corrupted. So I could try going back. But I don't know if that's a good idea. Alright. We're, we're not doing any of that. Any of those shenanigans. Oh, they broke through in the north.
This is a mountain province. Probably won't have much support there, but they are pushing us back slowly, which is concerning. There's a lot of industrial strength here, though, so kind of supporting that might help us out here. If Japan or Manchuria go to war, though, we're kind of fucked, because then all the volunteers go away.